Shout out to Chicago not taking the entire 10 minutes, you know? Thank that God. felt like there was about five minutes left, so. Look at the strut. Ooh. Here wow. we go. Wow. Three weeks, three weeks out of back surgery. Back surgery, yeah. You think yeah. he's been doing uh, cycling or something? You think he's peloton? He looks good. For right. sure. Pick. Body weight squats, maybe. 2024 man. NFL draft. The Chicago Bears select Caleb Williams. Hell yeah. What? Quarterback, Southern California. Congratulations oh, to Caleb Williams, number wow. one overall pick, as has been mm -hmm. projected for the last two years. Matt Mel, there was a little chatter for about a half a second or two that this wasn't going to take place about a month ago, but pretty matter of fact for the last two years or so. Yeah, a lot of people killed this guy basically saying, hey, we don't know about his character, his dad basically saying, hey, this guy wants to own an NFL team the day he gets drafted. Turns out that was all. You know, we saw him at his pro day, wrestling around with his teammates. You know, they seem to love him, but this kid has everything you'd want in a franchise quarterback. He's got the escapability, the elusiveness, the big rocket arm. Um, Chicago, now you finally got your guy. Now let's see what they can do. Coach Belichick, Caleb Williams is now going to be tasked with being a number one overall pick quarterback for a city that hasn't had a really prolific quarterback ever. How do you feel about Caleb and the pick for Chicago? Well, again, Caleb's a really talented guy. He's kind of like a Russell Wilson, uh, really good lower body, strong, pretty fast, and has a tremendous arm. He can make all the throws. He's got a lot of different motions and all that. Sometimes that helps him, sometimes uh, not so much. But uh, the kid's really talented. Um, I think if he can, you know, get – be more dependable, not turn the ball over, uh, be more dependable with his reads and more consistent and, and help the team that, you know, he's got a chance to be a real good player, obviously. All right, well, let's expand on that a little bit. Let's go to Bill Belichick's big breakdown. Whoa! This is six foot one, 215 pound Caleb Williams, number one pick out of USC, coach. Yeah, all right, well, here we go. I mean, you can see how quick and, and accurate he is on the release here. Just gets the ball, puts it right on the money. Easy for the receiver to, you know, have a catch and run here. Um, this is a third down 10 play. Uh, you know, he doesn't have anything. He's under pressure. He just kind of chucks the ball out and it's flat. I don't really like this. Those, these are the kind of plays that end up hurting him. Not so much on that one, but here's another example of his release. Quick release, balls out of his hand. Wow. Oof, wow. There it is. Oof, whoa. And, and those are good, solid plays in the NFL. Like, you need those. Okay, so here you see him handling the line of scrimmage, communicating the uh, route. Looks like he's changing the protection here. But if you watch this play, he, he gets the ball and he looks over to the defensive left, and then he just flips it over to the right side, the offensive left side. The receiver's not open. He, he throws the ball on top and hey, it's hey, an easy interception. <laughs> so those are the plays he's got to eliminate. But, I mean, this is a really good play here. He's backed up in his end zone. He looks to his right, comes back, reads all the way across the field, hits the crossing route. Uh, again, his quickness on his release and his accuracy are really good. And when he does this, that's when he's at his best. Uh, you know, here's a missed opportunity. You know, there's the in cut down there at the bottom. He's not under pressure, and he just – you know, pulls it down and starts running around. And, you know, now it's instead of second and one or maybe first down, yeah. it's third and ten. Uh, this, is a re this is really a spectacular play. This is what you love about Caleb Williams right here. Uh, UCLA is playing a, a kind of a flat coverage. You don't have any deep field player. Caleb steps up in the pocket and, you know, hits a 70-yard hits wow. touchdown. 58-yard ball, ball on off. one leg. Damn. Yeah. Freak. Here's pressure off the edge. Again, he does a nice job of handling the, uh, the free rusher off the edge and makes a good throw. Uh, you know, man-to-man -man coverage. Here's the open receiver right there. Put it on him. Mm. Holds the ball. Can't do that. Yeah, Come on, Caleb. Got to take the you, single. You, you, you got to get that. Now, this is a good throw right here. Third and 10. Hits the out cut right on time. Hell yeah. Excellent timing. Good third down conversion. Those are the ones you need. Here's a play down at the bottom. Linebacker blitzes. Uh, he's hot to the back, and he, he puts the ball perfectly for the back, just right in front of him. Uh, back's able to, you know, break a tackle here. And, and, yak, uh, yak, 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 yak. That throw enables the back to run with it and get good yardage. Uh, another good throw outside here. You know, gets a single coverage, makes a good read, good throw. Uh, again, good solid plays, and, and he's just got to, you know, try to make more of these and less of the every play being a 90-yard touchdown. Gets his eyes downfield here, makes a nice throw on the on the uh, extended play, and then this is a good back shoulder throw down here at the bottom. This time he he looks and sees the defenders on top of the receiver, puts it on the back shoulder, and you know again there's a lot of good things in the tape, some things he's got to work on. Biggest thing is don't turn the ball over. 
and don't try to do too much. Uh, you do too much early, you fall behind, you're playing from behind, it just makes it a tough day. Was well, in college football at USC or in the NFL? Well, a lot of college guys, I think, are putting a weight of the team on their back and making some reckless plays. You assume and you hope that you'll be able to eliminate those.